that the will of God is only that will prevail in the nation Ghana. And the will of God is the national prayer and thanksgiving service, which is the covenant still concerning our nation, need to be restored. And the bearer of this news, John Dramani Mahama, will sit on the seat of Ghana to restore this covenant of God so that the foundations of our nation will be rebuilt. This God wants to restore the country back to be in align with him. And that the, the covenant that was broken, the national prayer and thanksgiving service that was broken should be reenacted. When it is enacted, we'll be back in line. The man which which tenure that happened was John Dramani Mahama. That's why the Lord announced some time ago that he will be the next president of Ghana. Not be Abu Sinafu Mitiete Obi Biara. Akwalanya me and a monsa can is a CIA. Madam Akwalanya mina utini dino. Mina wensa kam is a siano. Mina mida pang soba spiritual and heba centano. Ya rie biya en kono. Anase we chinya 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 bre. Bibiti se apatitis. Bibiti se stroke. Stroke udye. E boni pa kura tuto form na wenti min kasa kura na masha u three days. Masuya ye uba minjisika. Tiye miye. Masuya ye uba minjisika. Na minu uba kwa apam. Unhu towa. Ase debi wakwa na wadi aba. Ben ma die. A die be cheno. E se se wa yi nu sori jina honu mu street. E mi se ubi ati ma se. Na sa die na sori an jina street. Di ane ye problem. E nu ane se uwa US o uwa UK. Uba biya uwa biya no. Uba fa me nomba. E nu ne gua se. E nu na wadi afreme. Ana se uba ba masuya ye. Wutu kwa in, sa wu kwa kwa pe bibi di abafiye. Wu kwa ya krata sema, juma sema. Chire sa wuna, wuda kura na wusun sumda ye basa, basa, basa. Anu ane sa ubefa pang soba nomba no. Na wa freme, wu freme insu awan sabe kame. Me kansi subyo, uba masuye ya, minjisika. Anu ane sa minu ube kwa pam, unhuto wa na wudi asida edi aba. A wu wa sem, a wu wa sem. Ube timanya sika wa ubotom, ne mwamu a wu wa ntino. Wamba tete wosama wun wunu babi ya ubesi. Wude di ebe yane se freme. Anase brema asu ya ye. Na ye ntira wose. Yadi ahahain. Ene esa yariye wa hanumu. Se ya wo 2024 mu. Na ye babe tuwa ba nun kwande. Enye deni ya manyukwe ni nina. Ebe chinchini nou ma bon tuwa. Nou ma kandu mbe tu mi aye. Eni du mbe tu mi edi abuwa oma eno. Na eno na gana mampeni da da ose pre ewo endi si jimu ura john domene mahama ujina si mpi isu na o kasa ena uchiru muse se ya sato abade manu 2024 ya oba ubeji da kubidi ya si wano mwa saada ni dura e kristo ufo nina abe kabum no mabompaye na umode nkoto sire usu eni asida edi ya machu edi ya mpo nyanko pong wase busumi bia ubeji da kupe edi ya si wano edi ya saadi eno na eno ena ama Prophet and as Apostle Chris Levite Zewonu, the voice of order. On us, all Kassan, which you must say, Sadi, you are a John Domain Mahama, a Kassa or Bao Bayenti, Nakupon Wasum, or Sur Asum, a Buff Wasum, a Humasum, and was it to me be our gun a beer, a pegan a year be asum, and it is a costly in a bath form. You are John Domain Mahama, and a baby in Abano. Was it? And people from Amuha Mokra, Mudia Mumpa Mumpa, I said, Dien, as some way you are John Domain Mahama Akaniti, or Soro, Asum, above when you are Asum. Aha, I have been full radio. Mumia Konya Kuti, Apostle Chris Levite Zewuno. Your Kuti Namra. The Mahama, respectfully, has agreed to restore the national prayer and thanksgiving service. Do you know what that means now? But that's what God has said. Now, if he has confessed it publicly, because that was the instruction, he has all confessed it publicly, it means that the deal is sealed about our nation. So today, what is today's date? Uh, today is 16th, 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 16th. 16th August, yes. 16th August. 16th August. So today, I am live talking about this to confirm as one of the key makers 
as the elections or the presidency of Ghana is concerned. And the table will tell around again. That it doesn't matter. I told you the first, the one of the king makers is Prophet Osu Bempa. So if Prophet Osu Bempa hears me, he should not give a counter pronouncement because it will happen again just as it happened in 208. No matter what you say, it won't happen. So he should keep his dignity. So I stand here as an apostle of the Lord Jesus Christ, as my nation Ghana is concerned, not NDC, not MPP. I stand in the name of our Lord, our God. On this day of our Lord, 16th August, 2024, that the will of God is only that will prevail in the nation Ghana. And the will of God is the national prayer and thanksgiving service, which is the covenant still concerning our nation, need to be restored. And the bearer of this news, John Dramani Mahama, will sit on the seat of Ghana to restore this covenant of God, so that the foundations of our nation will be rebuilt. This God wants to restore the country back to be in align with him. And that the, the covenant that was broken, the national prayer and thanksgiving service that was broken, should be reenacted. When it is enacted, will be back in line. The man which, which tenure that happened was John Dramani Mahama. That's why the Lord announced some time ago, that he will be the next president of Ghana, not because of political party or is better than anybody, or is a better candidate than no, but it is because the covenant that was broken concerning our nation happened in his time. And God is bringing him back so that that covenant can be well done, so that the things that God was supposed to do during his time, God will revisit it again, then put our nation in a very good when I read through the covenant for you, you heard it. God said, mills will build the foundation which the subsequent, the next government will build on. So during the eight years, the covenant was broken. So the foundation was not completed. Is somebody understand what we are talking about? We are not talking about political party. We are talking about the way of God concerned our nation. So the man whom through the covenants, the, the foundation supposed to be completed, John Dramani Mahama, who through the foundations were distorted, God, what God is saying in his plan is bringing that man back so that the foundations can be completed. When the foundations are completed, then any president that comes from then our nation will be in line. They will be flourishing. They will be flourishing. It is not simple to understand. Why is it that we, the prophets of God, we are not listening to God? Why are we following our own desires and mentioning the name of God in our desires? This one will win. This one will win. But all the things you are saying, it is not in line with the will of God concerning our nation. Now, somebody will say, Apostle, so what have you done concerning this in all this while? 